four. Just woken up. I'm gonna meet John and Luke for breakfast again. It's gonna be more of a shopping day today. So we're gonna be going through all the malls, um, looking for his stuff, trying to get some presents sorted for everybody. As you can see the view here, we got Fort Canning over there. Looks pretty cool. It's like a really big jungly area. Lots of um, landscape gardens and stuff like that. And across to the cityscape. On this side, we've got the pool down here. Yeah, it's pretty good. So I'm gonna head off now and then we'll catch up and I'll show you some interesting stuff. Every day I walk down these stairs and I get my morning fitness. Along with like a million other stairs. <laughs> Got the usual croissants and I'm trying a matcha frappuccino. Looks pretty good. And John's eating a banana. I have tea. Because he, he put the last banana he got in the freezer last night and it's all destroyed. <laughs> just finished breakfast and we're just heading up to a few gaming stores on the top floor of Plaza Singaporea. And if you can see, that egg place is chock-a-block again from the first day we were here. The line is mental. I don't get it. <laughs> Wayne Rooney, even though he doesn't even play for Man United anymore. Now we're off to the famous Orchard Road. I'm gonna go to Off White Selfie Cafe. Um, Selfie Cafe is in Bugis. In Bugis, and look around at the shops there and see what the go is. Yeah. Welcome to Orchard Road. What shop are we in, John? We are in Books Kinakaya in Orchard Road. And John's picking up No Game No Life. His favourite at the moment. So we're just picking that up and then we're gonna keep moving. <laughs> Do 
just finished up at Orchid Road. Now we're heading to Brass Brasia, which is where John's we're friend Jeanette we're under, works. We're underwater. Check out the view. Take a photo. Holy crap. The transport network here is ridiculous. Like the longest we've waited for a train or a bus this entire trip has been probably, the longest has probably been about three minutes. Like it's so good. And like there's so many tunnels and stations and it's so organized. We put $20 on our um, smart ride or whatever you want to call it, those um, card ticket devices. And I'm probably $20 and I've already spent probably 10. And that's for the whole time I've been here. So it's such good value. And just escalators everywhere. Okay, uh, there is a huge one just near here because this is kind of like the arts district. That's the yeah. We're in the arts precinct, Victoria Road. Do you have a bus there? Um, if you don't mind, you want burger for lunch, there's a burger place there. Oh, sweet, that works out. Then we can just walk to, then we can just walk to the biggest mall from there. Yeah. So we're gonna go to Selfie Coffee. Just got to Selfie Coffee. We're gonna get our photos taken on the froth of a coffee and we'll see what it turns out like. And then we're gonna go to the burger joint behind us for a lunch. But first, let me take a selfie. John taking a selfie for his coffee. I don't know what he's doing. This is probably his first ever selfie. <laughs> it is. So you take a photo on their on their iPod and then somehow they transfer it onto a froth. Here we go. The lady did say, um, take a photo before you put the straw in because it's just yeah. printed on the cream. Oh my god. We got me, <laughs> the, four, the four of us, and John with his very first selfie. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Yeah, tasty. Not good as Prime Minister. He's one of those guys who would be better off as a minister than an actual, you know, Prime Minister. Him talking Australian politics while in Singapore in a selfie coffee shop know. while we eat our own faces. I guess I took a good selfie. selfie, 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 selfie. Selfie coffee was actually a very good coffee. Eight dollars and we got a decent sized drink with our face on it. I would highly recommend it. Really, really good. Now we're gonna go to Berg, Gourmet Burgers. I will let you know how we go. John's getting the budgie smuggler. Yeah. You might have to eat and run, Jeanette. Thank you. I'm going to take my name right And chips. See you, Jeanette. Yeah, See you, Jeanette. Thanks See you tonight. I got the all day breakfast with a hash brown, egg, and avocado. It's like ridiculously good. $11. Luke, fourteen fifty over there, and with chips and a drink, about twenty bucks. Anyway, really recommend this place. Just finished up at the selfie cafe and the burger place. Uh, highly recommend it. They were both very good, decent for what it was. Like the coffee was eight bucks and the burger I got was 12. 20 bucks, that's pretty good. Can't really fault it really. And then we got the honeycomb building behind us, we've named it. This ridiculous buildings.
air conditioning. Holy man. It's like six levels up. Left to explain. Maybe this could reach you. Suntech. We're gonna have a look around for some gifts for people. My favorite shopping and center. And hopefully we'll find some good stuff. There is so much left to explain. train to Chinatown and now we're going to head down and get some dinner basically Chinatown Look in orbit I just want to feel something Hard to tell if there's emotion Something I should let you We found the world famous transport ban durian, banned on all public transport in Singapore. Just got our meals. Jeanette got Indian with a side of meat. John got some street food. Street food. Deep fried. Deep, Deep fried, fried street food. Deep fried goodness. And I got Thai. Green curry. A huge bowl of Thai green curry. It's a oh. lot. So yeah, that's your bell. You want to get back? I will. And I'm just about to have a chicken drumstick. Drum <laughs> chicken Chinese drumstick. Deep. It is currently 10.15 and we're just walking past our local Starbucks and it is absolutely packed at 10.15 at night. Ridiculous. There isn't a seat in this place. <laughs> there is not a seat in the entire shop. That's ridiculous. Anyway, that wraps up today's video. We're just heading back to the hotel after we got some supplies. Hope you enjoyed our day shopping. Drop us a comment and a like, and we'll see you tomorrow. We're going to Sentosa Island and hopefully Gardens by the Bay, and that's the last day of our Singapore adventure. Peace.